Heritage Auctions presents the upcoming Western Art Signature Auction set for May 5th. Joseph Henry Sharp, Brownell McGrew, and Berger Zanzen highlight this sale. In Balling Deer by Firelight, the subject sits before an unseen fire, pensively holding a hide drum. The glow of the fire, itself excluded from the composition, bathes Balling Deer in warm rays of crimson light. At his feet, a beaded tobacco pouch and Catlinite pipe have been cast aside. Sharp has captured the wistful gaze of the Taos Indian as he sits surrounded by these artifacts of the Plains tribes. Balling Deer has become an iconic representation of Sharp's extensive Indian portraiture. Children of the Sun illustrates the best of McGrew's talents as an artist and storyteller. The setting is the sun-drenched, multicolored desert and mountain landscape of the Navajo Reservation. He has populated his canvas with several Navajo children in traditional dress, which is painted in intricate detail. Most likely, these are people that the artist knew well and whom he had observed on many occasions. The figure of the small girl in the foreground is a motif that he frequently used in his paintings. The work can be seen simultaneously as an overall scene of Navajo life on the reservation and as a series of small individual vignettes. One of the foremost American wildlife artists, Clymer captures animals in their natural setting, paying as much attention to the accuracy of the landscape as to the figures themselves. The artist's expert draftsmanship is the result of many hours of study and research in the field. One of the founding members of the Taos Society of Artists, Kaus honed his artistic skills through rigorous academic training. Falling in love with the native culture of northern New Mexico, Kaus spent his summers beginning in 1902 painting the people of this brilliant region. His portraits capture the spirit of his sitters and document a way of life that was already disappearing at the turn of the 20th century. This early landscape was completed 16 years after Zanzen immigrated to America and helps document his progression as an artist. The quiet, almost tonalist canvas reveals the journey Zanzen had already begun towards his mature style and although not yet fully realized, this already belies his sensitivity as a landscape painter. Remember, these are just a few of the pieces of art available May 5th. For more information and photos, please log on to ha.com slash 5095. Thank you and good luck.